Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to install the plug and driver for Mark IV using this HBO4 in the back showing WHBO4-L USB wireless First you need to copy this link I will provide it to you Copy and download download anyway and then right click after it's done down finish download right click show the folder close the browser out and I'm using the 7 zip so right click extract the file okay now you have to extract file already drag it to your desktop and close this out and you open this you open your driver and drag it to the right size okay now you go to my computer and go to your Mach 4 folder and go to under Mach 4 folder go to plug and drag these folders to the left side uh, you see how it's going right now okay so your plug your Mark 4 plug, your Mark 4 folder plug is on the right, on the left side. Let's see, Mark 4 will be on the left side, and your driver gonna be on the right side. So click, go to your driver, click here, and copy two of these to your plug, your Mark 4 plug. So. Okay, it is here. So your driver, copy two of these folders from your driver to your Mark 4 plug folder. Okay, so now close your Mark 4 folder. Under your driver, you need to download your Microsoft. If you don't have, if you don't have that updated, I'm using the window. I'm using the Windows 10. Um, 64 bit so so you need to download these okay let's start our work let's I'm close this open your driver go here go here go here and I'm using 64 bit so I choose 64 bit and run as, as administrations and download your Microsoft Visual C Success. You will see it right here. You will see it right here. After you download, it will show right here. Okay. So now go to Mark 4. This video is going to be a long one. So, now in my core, go config, control, and go to plug tap and enable it. My rate enable it, so it needs to be green and apply. Okay. Close your Mark 4 out. Okay, now you already have your plug in the Mark 4. Okay, now you need to download the driver. Well, well, first, before you download the driver, you need to restart your computer. 
and turn it into uh, disable uh, force uh, something like that so you need to uh, yeah I'm thinking hold on you need to press the ship uh, sorry I'm holding my phone it's kind of difficult you need to press the ship key Press and hold the shift key and restart your computer. Okay, so press and hold the shift key and restart your computer. Continue to hold your shift key though. Continue to hold your shift key. Wait until it pop up troubleshoot. So now choose troubleshoot. Event options. start up you need after these you need to make turn your co computer into disable driver signature enforcement okay so restart Okay, now you need to choose seven, number seven, disable driver signature enforcement. So you need to use the number of functions key F1 to nine, one to nine, choose F7. Okay, press F7 on your keyboard. F7, okay, F7. Okay. Now open your No. Now open your start. Go to your start and go to your window system. On the window system, go to control panel. And Hardware and sound, and go to device. Let's close it out. Now go to human interface device right here. Uh, there you go, human interface device. So right now my computer has one, two, three, four USB already plugged in. So uh but this one I haven't plugged in yet. So if I plug this in it will show four of the USB input device. So right now before you do that, you need to open all these four first. One drag it over here. Okay. The second one right click properties and then drag over here and do the third one property right click drag down here and you see they all look the same only this number is different you see even though these two look the same too so you need to go to events so they all should look different now okay as you can see there's four four device here four USB input device are here because I open all their properties one two three 
four and four properties would be all right here so if I plug this thing in four this would turn into five USB instead of four right now because my every diff every computer is different because depend on how many USB you plug it in so you gotta find which USB for these for this wireless HBO 4 okay so sorry guy bear with me I have a hard time plug this thing in okay I'm gonna plug this thing in it will showing five see you will hear the background so right now it's ready five here so you don't know which one is which because they all look the same so let's start from beginning again right click and see which one is pop up properties nope the first the first one is not pop up which is right here already you see this thing highlighted okay the second one there you go the second one is pop up so pop the second one will be the right one so let's close that and then do the third one to verify it. No, nope, no pop up. So your third one be right here. Fourth one, no pop up either. And then go to the fifth one. Fifth one not pop up either. So now you know it's the the second one will pop up the right one see so you know that one already then right click update driver click here and click here let me pick from my list and check I have this browns and your driver you earlier we put it in their desktop so your driver should be in a desktop so right click right click right click right click I have window 10 and 64 bit so Windows X here's a driver and Click open or you can click double click and OK and you see it show here now next install the driver anyway now let's close all these properties Okay, now you see it's pop right there. You see your driver right there. So now it's working. Okay, now you open your Mark IV. And turn this thing on. The number in here, the number in here is changed to match with your Mark IV, um, right here. So to verify, it's enable plug. It's right there. Plug's already right there. Enable. So now let's start moving one of the Excel. Okay. So, sorry, I have to hold my phone. Show you guys. You see how the digital on on these kind of match with on Mark IV. 6.000, negative 16, 15. You see there? So, uh, 
Oh crap. I need too much. One, this should be good. You see right there? Uh, let's do 10. Uh, let's do one. See one right there. Okay. So I'm moving my XO. Let's see. Okay, my XO is moving. Moving little by little. Sorry, guys. It's kind of messy here. So I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do tan instead. Tan is just kind of slow. Let's do 100. I haven't calibrated this yet, so. So it's working now. So the number is matching. That's it. Thank you for watching.